So all of this looks fantastic. Like I said, limited brunch menu, but it seems like all the food items came out great. So um, yeah, we're gonna dig in. What's up guys, welcome to a brand new video. Today we are over at the Boathouse because they have a brand new brunch. Brand new brunch at the Boathouse. This is the second weekend that they've been doing it and we're super excited to give it a try. Uh, we have come to the Boathouse a handful of times for cocktails and uh, yeah. you know little appetizers, but this is really our first full sit-down dinner here. And so I am really excited because we're big breakfast people. Yes, exactly. It's a beautiful Sunday. It's about in the mid-80s, which is crazy for February and also probably makes the rest of the world hate Florida just a little bit more but um yeah so the brunch is brand new and also starting at 11 every day on Sunday 11 to 2 I believe they do dueling pianos we pass the two piano players and a kicker which I didn't do but just for you guys to know if you wear a captain's hat here you get a free mimosa so that's he just was something too to remember. Shy to wear his captain's hat I didn't have a captain's hat to be completely <laughs> honest with you but I should probably buy one because if there's free mimosas I'll buy whatever hat I need to buy but yes so I'm sure this uh, brunch is, you know, somewhat seafood oriented. In fact, I'm already seeing, you know, uh, shrimp and lump crab Salmon and all bagels, sorts of stuff like that. Grits, but it's a small menu, but it looks really good. So we're going to go figure out what we want to eat. Yeah, and we're going to review this place. If you guys are new to our channel, welcome. We are the Date Hoppers. We go around and do dates and much, much more. And we have a whole series uh, on Disney Springs restaurants. So, yeah. Yeah. Welcome to another review. So, we ordered some drinks and they also brought us over some rolls, so tell them a little bit about that. Yes, so um, unfortunately we only have one roll left because we got a little anxious there. Because we got excited. Um, but they're just regular dinner rolls, but they're covered in icing and a little bit of cinnamon sugar, comes along with some butter, so it's a, a nice little brunch appetizer, which usually isn't a thing, but yeah. I will take it. I haven't really been to a brunch, brunch before where they bring you like bread or rolls, because obviously that's a thing for dinner and, uh, you know, sit downs, but, but you know, so this is a nice little twist. And we got a few different cocktails. Yes, so uh, we started off with a round of cocktails this morning. Um, I have here a pear mosa. It's a pear cider with some peach puree in it. Um, and then Jared got a similar beverage. He got the... The uh, strawberry splash. Which is basically a uh, Carperberg strawberry. I don't know what that is. But it it's has... It's another cider. It also has <laughs> lime cider and stuff like that. Uh, it's very tasty. So they're just really fun twists on, you know, morning brunch cocktails. They do have, you know, mimosas and bellinis, and they also have Bloody Marys, espresso martinis, so. Yeah, as you can see, guys, the brunch menu itself is not very big. Um, there are five highlighted brunch cocktails that, like, they market as their brunch morning drinks, um, and then they have roughly around eight different items to pick for for food. And junior so. skipper meals for you. Um, um, but she actually recommended like some of the lunch items and just like having it for brunch just because they're famous for their meats. Yes. So uh, I might even get one of those and maybe throw a fried egg on top. I'm not sure. That sounds delicious. We will see. But uh, I hope you guys enjoyed all the footage too. I tried to get you guys some footage of the piano players over there. They are playing. Um, and yeah, it's beautiful outside. A lot of people love to sit outside. As you can see at the very end there, there's that dockside bar. So, yes. It's a beautiful day. It's a beautiful day. All right, so we will, you know, film some more once we have more food. Catch you on the food. So we got our food. 
What did you order? So I got the avocado toast. It comes with multi-grain toast, uh, avocado, pickled onions, tomato, feta cheese, topped with two eggs of your choice, and then a delicious little side salad as well. I got myself a side of bacon, but this looks beautiful. Thank you so much. Well, lemons. <laughs> um, yeah, so uh, that looks gorgeous. Um, and um, I got just a classic breakfast. Uh, so it just comes with a few pieces of toast. Uh, it is ciabatta bread, and ciabatta bread is awesome. Uh, bacon, home fries, uh, eggs, and also I got a side of crab because we are at the boathouse and you have to get seafood, right? So. And yeah. then we also have our friend Holly. Yes. That got. A big ass waffle. Yes, the Belgian waffle um, with the side of bacon and all that. Um, so I am so ready to dig in and eat my toast. Yes, so all of this looks fantastic. Like I said, limited brunch menu, but it seems like all the food items came out great. So um, yeah, we're gonna dig in. What do you think? I'm so full. <laughs> it was all delicious though. Uh, still got some more work to do, but like I said, I ordered a little side of crab. Um, and I asked them like, what's the best way to do just like a little bit of crab or something. And there's a side of it for about $10. They put it into a little bowl. And uh, yeah, just asked for some lemon, put some of this uh, steakhouse salt on it. And it is delicious, especially with that ciabatta bread. So. Highly recommend that. And Molly is uh, full. I'm yeah. slowing down. Yeah, but everything was delicious. Holly even liked her Belgian waffle. It was all very good. Um, so yeah, we do. We definitely do recommend. What I would suggest if you guys are going to come here is sit near the dueling pianos because that's a part of the experience. Definitely a cool part of it. Or sit outside, uh, especially when it's gorgeous out. Uh, fortunately, we could get neither of those, but that's all right. It's a busy Sunday. Sunday, and, it's and we out. walked in with no reservation, so yeah. So I mean, either way, delicious food. So thank you so much. So yeah, we'll check up again Jared, with you in a bit. Oh yeah, I ordered more cinnamon buns because they're amazing. Because I'm fat, that's why. All right, so we're done. We are done. My bellies are full. Now we're gonna go walk it all off. Yeah, that's the beauty of Disney. You just get fat and then you walk it off. And then you eat again. Yeah, nothing crazy. But yeah, so we're just right outside of, right out front, the boathouse. It's a beautiful location right here in the center of Disney Springs and right behind us are these awesome little... Amphi cars. Yeah. Amphi cars. They cost, I believe, $80 to rent for 30 minutes. Yeah, it's pretty cool. We'd love to do it eventually. That would be a cool video, but anyways. Sunday. Thank you so much for tuning in. If you're new to the channel, please hit subscribe, like, comment, all that good jazz. We're also on TikTok, Instagram, and Facebook. And uh, yeah, we do videos. We're trying to do every week, so usually every Friday, come back for a new video. Uh, and, you know, request content in the comments. We always are receptive to that. Let us know what you want to see. Yeah. We love trying out new places. Absolutely. Let people know where we like to go. Yeah, and we, we absolutely love doing these uh, Disney Springs dining reviews. We're trying to hit a video at every single restaurant at Disney Springs. So uh, check out our other nine or ten reviews. And uh, if you ever need any help with Orlando and more, come find us. Hit us up. All right, we'll catch you on the flip-flop. See you next time.